Hello ladies and gentlemen, I just want to say, I just got a few things to ask you guys. If there was any type of... Okay, say Battlefield 4. You'd have a DLC right now. Any DLC. I know one just went by. But, if you could pick anything that, that, that thing, that, um, it could be possibly done. Like, it's possible that DICE could do it, and, like, EA would, you know, say, yeah, sure, whatever. What, what would you want the DLC to have? Like, camos? Um, game modes? Guns? Sparkles? Chicken fingers? Manies on trees? Floating hot dogs? Floating umbrellas? I know you guys are thinking floating dildos, but you know, we don't care about that right now. Not up to that. Um, but yeah, what would it be? And don't half of you guys, if you guys are watching, half of you guys, if you guys are watching, people are gonna say, uh, freaking better things, you know? Like, make the game better, like, fix the, all the things that are wrong with it, but guess what, it's not possible. And the people that are actually staying with us, like staying with Battlefield, all that, they are super nice, because they know that DICE will come back and actually do something with it, hopefully, or they might just say, you know what, this game was a fail, we're not going to try to fix it. And I'm guessing they're probably focusing on the new Battlefield or new project. They're probably getting paid more and all that. But, you know, I think DICE will actually come back and actually maybe fix this. Or they might just make a complete new game and hopefully uh, do stuff better. And, you know, if they made more, more DLC for the games, people will... People will won't care about all the problems that they have. They'll ignore it and say, "Whoa, this game is actually cool." Without all those things, and if they have it all fixed, be a perfect game. But you know, there's no such thing as a perfect person. So why would you think there's going to be a thing called a perfect game? I sort of think Watch Dogs can be a perfect game, but it's not. I, I just know it was not because the graphics. It's not the best on the Xbox One. They didn't try, I don't think, for the Xbox One. I wish they did. Probably the story's not gonna be the best. It's probably gonna be long. Like it's got hold for like two years, two or f two years, I'm pretty sure. So you know that's that's a good thing, but you know I don't think it's gonna be like perfect game. You see how the cars look, and like, I don't know, like, imagine if the GTA, if GTA cars would be in it, that'd be cool, but, you know, it wasn't, and there's still awesome things in it, and awesome, freaking awesomeness, but, you know, it's not the very best, and if it was, it wouldn't be real, would it, exactly. But, you know, if it was, then it'd be really cool. And when there is, that's going to be so much in the future. Everything's going to be a lot weirder in the future. Like, why would you want... If if everyth if the games were perfect, then they're probably going to make people perfect. And we don't want everybody to look the same, would they? I don't know. Exactly. And Watch Dogs is a cool game, cool campaign game. Has a cool multiplayer thing set up. Um, nice bubbles, you know they worked super hard on that. You know, in real life, it costs three grand to do that for like an hour. So, yeah, it's expensive for Dice to actually do that. Oh, Kyrax. Oh, shoot. Oh, my God. So, I just want to talk about that. I forgot what I started off with. But, you know. I just want to say that... 
dice will hopefully work and there's no such thing as a perfect game. Like there's no such thing as a perfect person. Because if there was a perfect 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 person then the world would be weird. And weirder. And I epic you feel. So guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a sparkle in the description, please. Hopefully that's not a reference for anybody else's. I just made that up. Hopefully that I can actually still use it. 